You're tuning into Black and White Sports on YouTube. The no holds barred truth on sports. The main event starts now. Black and White Sports fans, we may have a war on our hands when it comes to Usain Bolt and Shikari Richardson. Now, the other day, my partner in crime here on the channel, Rhodes Rants, did a video about Usain Bolt basically telling Shikari Richardson to shut up and train harder. Because remember, she was actually suspended for failing a drug test. That's why she was not selected to go to the Olympics. But she returned and she finished dead last. Dead last, folks. The Jamaicans, they beat her up pretty good in that meet. And she was talking a lot of trash, guys. And when the GOAT, Usain Bolt, gives you advice, I probably would listen to it. You know why? Because the man has eight Olympic gold medals. You guys want to know how many Shakira Richardson has? She has zero. A big, fat goose egg. So he has her beat eight to nothing. But however, she does have him beat one nothing when it comes to drug suspensions. But Shakira Richardson now has fired back at Usain Bolt. Over here on the New York Post, Shakira Richardson fires back at Usain Bolt over train harder advice. I guess apparently she didn't like that he was telling her that she should be training harder. That's how champions are made, you know. But I guess she doesn't want to be a champion. It says here, American sprinter Shakari Richardson appeared to fire back at retired Olympic sprinter Usain Bolt for suggesting in an interview with the Post that she should focus on training over trash talking. Yeah, nobody should be talking trash when you finish dead last. Richardson took to her Instagram story on Sunday, according to a screen grab by the shade, the shade room to repost a fan comment. She reposted a fan comment. This wasn't even on words right here. Okay. Repost a fan comment that read quote, everybody wants to give advice in the media, but none of them actually take the time to speak to her outside of the media. So I feel her stop speaking on me when you don't even speak to me. Close quote. Now, guys, I really don't even know. If you saying both even knows Shikari Richardson, I don't know if they, they've ever talked before. I mean, think it, think of this, guys. The man is in Jamaica. She's out here in the U.S. I believe she's in Oregon or something like that. So if if he wants to give advice in the media, that was pretty harmless, you know, just train harder. That's all he was saying. I believe that's fair. I really do. It says here the 21 year old Richardson added her own words to the post writing, quote, good humbling morning to y'all. And I could not have said it better. So she 100 percent agrees with this comment here from this fan of hers on Instagram. Yeah, don't speak to me in the media. OK. In the second slide, Richardson wrote. Y'all haven't seen, y'all haven't even heard the half of me over a photo of herself smirking with a legs cross. Well, we haven't heard half of you. Well, you've been speaking a lot, but we did see you coming dead last. The only way you can rectify that is to get back on the track field and win. You know, stop smoking the weed and getting suspended and stop coming in last place. Shakari Richardson's appearance to me now is that maybe she's trying to come off as some kind of a victim now. Maybe she is. Maybe the media is going to slam Usain Bolt for giving this advice, you know, because he's going after her, even though I believe he's just trying to actually really be positive, you know, and give her good advice. During his interview with the Post, Bolt said, quote, if you talk that bit talk, you have to back it up. I would tell Shakari to train harder and to be focused and not say too much. So just train hard and focus on that and try to come back and do it and then talk about it, said Bowden, eight time Olympic gold medalist. 
Richardson returned to the track in August at the Prefontaine Classic in Eugene, that's in Oregon, following her Tokyo Olympics ban due to a failed drug test for marijuana. After teasing her return in various social media posts, she finished last out of nine runners in the 100 meters and withdrew from the 200 meters. Jamaica's Elaine Thompson Hera won the race. Bolt, a Jamaican native, also explained that Richardson's, quote, shit talking makes her vulnerable to rival Jamaican competitors. Quote, Jamaicans are vets because she was talking a lot of shit before the actual race. It is just one of those things, he said. Jamaicans don't like when people talk shit about us because we are a very proud people. So if you talk about us, we are going to want to want you to back it up. It definitely gave those women the extra push to win. Richardson rose to fame when she won the 100 meter on the same track in Oregon at the U.S. Olympic trials in June. But what did it get her? It got her nothing. She has won nothing since that Olympic trial. She has been an utter failure. And you same boat just giving her good advice. But Shikari Richardson has to go out there on Instagram, share a story of somebody else's words to clap back at Usain Bolt. I would have took the advice, man. The man's the GOAT. The man has won eight Olympic gold medals for a reason. If he's giving you advice, Shikari Richardson, I would highly, highly take it. That's just my thoughts on this. What do you guys think of this? Black and white sports fans. Shikari Richardson doesn't seem to want the advice of an eight-time Olympic gold medalist. Why she has zero. Anyway, guys, let us know what you think about all this in the comments. Make sure you subscribe to Black and White Sports, and we'll catch you next time. Thanks for watching the show. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Be sure to tune in next time on Black and White Sports.